and we should set it clean here. Diffuse magic. It's fine. A cocoon. It's fine. And we got him. There we go. That is a 21 Vortex panel plus 43. We hit 2,700. Hell yeah. Yeah, what's going on, everybody? This is Mystical. Tonight, I am bringing you a plus 21 Vortex Pinnacle where we timed it with five minutes to spare. We absolutely crushed this dungeon. These are the talents I run. I am fist weaving this time around. I saw some people wanting to see some fist weaving. This is a fist weaving um, keystone, which is great. Um, this is the talent builds I run every single time. I don't really change it that often. Still trying to decide. It, maybe someone can help me out here. Is, if Yulon's Grease or Diffuse Magic is better, I don't know. I feel like Diffuse Magic is still good because it's just an extra cooldown you can use to rotate. And on the right-hand side, this is what I use every single keystone. There is absolutely nothing that I change. So uh, my damage breakdown is, of course, Rising Sun Kick, Blackout Kicks, and then my healing breakdown... I guess I got out healed by the tank by a little bit, but Ancient Teachings is obviously my number one heal, followed by Shaylin's Gift to Gust and Mist. And that is pretty much it. If you have any questions at all, please let me know. I am more than happy to answer any questions you might have. And that's it. Hope everyone's fantastic rest of your day. Hope you enjoy the video. I'll see you later. All right. Here is a plus 21 Vortex Spinnacle, and I do not want to be here <laughs> at all. I think, I don't even know. I think I've done a this on a 15. We are fist sweeping, though. I got some questions about some fist weaving, so I'll try to fist weave as much as I can. After this, there we go. I'm coming in hot. I'm coming in hot. Get over here. There we go. And uh, yeah, we're gonna try our best. I got a new trinket too from the new raid or from the uh, from my mythic chest. So uh, this is a pretty big pull. So I'm a little a little concerned because I have not done a pull this size here uh, ever. So. Uh, but I guess we're just going to Chi G. We've already used Chi G because I <laughs> didn't know we were going to pull this much. Uh, otherwise, you Chi G right now, and then we're just going to crank damage um, pretty much as much as we can. Um, really, nothing else. Put our hots out as well. Extend these hots with our Rising Mist. I'm going to send a little thing. I'm going to use my or my Gnome Racial there as well. And uh, just kind of do damage here, I think. Diffuse Magic this on use. Try to kill this. Nice. And this is, I'm assuming, an Augmentation Evoker. This is one of the first, actually. I think this is the first time I've played with an Augmentation Evoker in a Keystone. So we'll kind of see how it goes. Uh, I'm probably just going to cheat you now. It's Fort Week, right? So, um, oh, no. I'm going to die. No. Oh, thank God. Um, so I don't mind using cooldowns on, on Trash because, again... Fort Week bosses in here aren't too bad, except for the second boss. I absolutely uh, despise the second boss. It's no secret. I it's the reason I don't want to be here right now, honestly. But when the guild calls, and I actually kind of want some IO too. I'm, I, I would like to push like 3k. I think I'm like 20, almost 2700 now. Somehow pugging though never gets easier. You know, I always make the mistake every season of pushing IO and. Thinking it'll be easier the higher you get. And uh, surprise, it's not. <laughs> but we'll see. Um, yeah, I got the Mana Trinket. This uh, I don't know the name of it to spell here. Um, I need to make my Dispel on uh, mouse over, a Mouse Over Macro. Like a Mouse Over Macro for it. Because uh, I have pretty much everything Mouse Over Macro except for Dispel. I'm trying to think of anything else. Dispel here. I have everything else mouse over it pretty much. And for some reason, my frames are absolutely fried right now. What? They're like sorted wrong. Ever since the beginning of the patch, like my frames in Arena and in Mythic Plus have just been cooked. So I thought this was the tank the whole time. <laughs> I thought this was the tank the whole freaking time, dude. Um, so that's awkward. What's going to cheat you here? Sweep and uh, roll out. I'm going to go for an envelop mist here, spin, and then blackout kick. We should have an instant enveloping. Oh, my God. I was I was actually doing so much healing on the non-tank. Oh, my God. Okay. I need to unrest. It's been a little bit, but hope everyone's having a great day. Um, there's not too much going on with this trash. It's just a lot of trash, really. Um, I do have three stacks of Shaylin's Gift. I'll probably, I'll probably send it. Um... Diffuse Magic this, also Gnome Racial this, at around seven or eight stacks as normally, because you want to get good value out of the, the buff, right? You want like a good amount of time on the buff. So I, I tend to normally 
Dude, could you imagine if I took the solo shuffle pop mid Keystone? I thought it removed me from Q <laughs> when I joined the group. <laughs> okay. Uh, nah, I would never do that. Not to my boys. All right, we got a big Shaylin's gift here, so we should be okay. Um, yeah, not too much. Again, not too much going on with trash here. Um, you do, we do have multiple uh, defensives we can rotate between as well, but for the most part, this this isn't too much. It's just like mostly this dungeon is just mostly trash. Honestly, it's just doing trash and doing damage. It does feel. I feel like I do so much damage with augmentation. Holy cow! I'm loving it. Thank you, bud. Thank you, bubs. Yeah, big damage here. And they actually do a decent amount of damage, it looks like, too. That's crazy. Cool. And healing? Wow. Yeah, nice. We got to not stand in that. If we died, that would have been really sad. I would really like to fix my frames as well. I don't know what is causing them to do this. this these guys have some AoE damage going out, so we kind of want to focus one. Don't really know who we're hitting, but I am going to Chiji here just to get the Chi Cocoon on people because here comes the Turbulence, and I'm just going to try to heal as much as I can. Use your Healing Elixirs as well. Envelope Mist on my Druid. I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to Shaylin's Gift, and I'm going to Gnome Racial that, and we're just going to keep trying to do damage. I do have... I'm going to Diffuse Magic here, and I do have Revival as well, so um, I feel like we should be okay, though. I'll use my Anu's Trinket here and just try to do damage. I'm still trying to... I think I need to make a weak order to kind of track that. But I think for the most part, we're doing pretty good. Um, I'm not playing the Yulon's... What is it? Yulon's Whisper, I think, is what it's called. Tiger's lost this. Um, hopefully kill this before it. Nice. Beautiful. Yeah, we're doing chilling. Mana, mana on Fist Weaving is so insane. I forgot how good mana is on, on Mystery. I'm good. I'm 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 good. Yeah, we're chilling right now. There, there ain't nothing to worry about right now. Uh, this boss, I can go through the mechanics. He has the lightning bolt that you want to kick, you know, just to stop some damage going out. And then most of the, uh, most of the mechanics are just these orbs and the tornadoes. Uh, what I try to do is try to always try to align yourself in between the tornadoes because what's going to happen is he's going to pull in the tornadoes soon, I'm hoping. I got you, brother. He's going to pull in the tornadoes soon. And you're not going to be able to avoid it if you get die. So you just, you just, you, you can just backpedal between, you know. And I'm going to go for a nine stack or shaylin's gift here. That should be okay. I also have healing mixers to give myself. And we're chilling. Good. Perfect. Wait, what? I don't know what just hit me. I don't know if an orb hit me. My bad. If I did, that was my fault. I did not see it. If uh, I did get hit by it. Kick that. And I'm just trying to maximize my damage as much as I can. I prioritize blackout kicks, or rising sun kick is your highest priority. And you obviously use, I'm just gonna cocoon there. Big healing, good. Big healing. And then I, I still have, I'm gonna Chiji here. I thought the tornadoes are coming out sooner than that. There we go. We're on a Feyline Stomp, so we should be okay. Yeah, we should be fine here. Feyline Stomp here. Blackout Kick. Because, again, the Blackout Kick hits twice. Rising Sun Kick. Good. Good. Kick that. I don't think the Shadow Priest can silence, so we have, like, three, four kicks. Good. Perfect. Should I just Todd? Yeah. Okay, good. And I have a... F I'll just send the four stack out. Healing looks for myself as well. Can I hit this? No. Nah. Maybe I can. Might just be blind. All right, good. Perfect. Perfect. Well done. Well done so far. Yeah, wow. It feels really good with, the <laughs> with an augmentation booker. Holy cow. I feel like I do so much damage. My Shaylin's gift is cranking. I thought I wasn't fist weaving for a second there. Why? Okay, I guess most of the, I guess most of the uh, damage from that is just during the phase where I Shaylin's gift. So, I guess that's fair. Chiji here, spinning crane kick, big healing. Nothing should die right now. Sweep everything. Gnomeness, big healing. Nice uh, solar beam there. Wrap that cloud burst. Ninety k. Are you kidding me? My God. 
This is insane. Look at my Shadow Priest damage right now. Holy cow. 300k damage. That's insane. Yeah, I I guess Augmentation is pretty good. I've seen it in Arena, you know, obviously, like, they don't die. But you don't realize how strong they are for your team until you actually, like, do a Keystone or something. Oh. Oh, no. I think he just got one shot. I guess it's super bolstering, so. My bad. Todd? Yeah. Are we... Okay, we're pulling the other side. That's fine, too. We're doing Mist here. Good. Chi Burst. Uh, I'm just going to cheat you here and just crank. I'm going to sweep everything. Yeah. I need to, I would like to... Yeah, Phalanx Stomp here. On your Trinket. Let's just crank right now. Just kick that. Expel Harm. I have a 10 stacker Shaylin's Gift. If we start falling behind... I can use that. Nice knock on that Cloud Burst. So good. I'm just going to go for it. 10 stacker. Big healing here. Good. On use. Nice. Beautiful. Nice silence there on the uh, Vapor Form. No racial this. Really good. I'm just going to Chi Burst here. Why not? Just send it. I think I like Chi Wave, chi wave more than Chi Burst because there was one time in Freehold I accidentally pulled a, uh, like a trash pack by accident with my Chi Burst. And then I blamed one of the DPS. <laughs> not me, but the tank <laughs> blamed one of the DPS. I was like, ooh, my bad, guys. Sorry. All right, so now we're going to start taking some AOE damage. I'm just going to diffuse magic here on use. Do we just... Yeah, we dodge this. We're going to Chi-G here. And we're just going to crank right now. I wish... I don't have a... Uh, let's go revival this, too. Um, I don't think I have a weak order to track Ebon. Look how many buffs I have right now for Ebon Might. But I, I, it's probably worth it, right? Because Ebon Might is probably kind of important to uh, track right there. You get a ton of intellect. God damn, dude. Yeah, big damage here. Todd. Nice. Well done. All right, listen. If we kill this next boss... I'll be happy, okay? Uh, I'll be ecstatic, okay? It's the reason I'm not, I don't like doing this place. It's this next boss. I just want to be able to dispel this. I just want to be able to kill it. It's literally it, you know? It's my only dream. It's my only desire in life. Is to freaking kill Altarius, okay? It's that simple. Doing a lot of damage, though. Should I just... I'm trying to think, like, maybe I should just, like, spin? I'm going to send the six stacker. I get damage reduction and more haste. Yeah, let's do that. I feel like I know the fight. Like, it's not like... Because, uh, like, so on some bosses, I admittedly, like, maybe I don't know everything. Like, the total of everything. But I swear, for the most part, I know every, every boss fight, right? GG here, we... I, I think we just accidentally pulled. So, we're going to try to recover here. We're going to try, try our best to recover. We do have Chi-G. Diffuse magic here as well. Okay. I'm just going to go for it. Nine. Yes, good, good. Chi burst here. Okay, let's go. Sweep everything. These are these these guys are pretty annoying. I'm not going to lie. They, these are some pretty annoying mobs. Nice knock on that. Vapor form went off on one of them. I think I'll just dampen harm here so I don't do any damage. And then kind of just... Use Enveltment Mist on my tank and then keep extending it with the Rising Sun Kick. Gnome Racial that. You can you can rotate your Gnome Racial and your Tiger's List on the Vines, by the way. So keep that in mind. You should be able to just easily deal with the... Honestly, I don't even think it's an affix. I'm going to be quite honest. I'm just going to top this. I don't even think it's much of an affix uh, when you're Gnome. I say that like everybody's a Gnome Monk. <laughs> You know, <laughs> not everyone's a gnome, I guess. I guess we're skipping the dragon, which I don't mind. Okay. We don't like that dragon. Chi here. And we should be okay. I'm going to Thunder Focus the Envelopment Mist the Druid just because it seems like he's kind of... My boy's taking it right now. So, sweep everything. Okay, perfect. We should... Yeah. Our Blackout Kicks are hitting everything right now. And uh, it does look, sometimes it does look like I'm not hitting anything, even though I am. It's because I use a macro. I mostly use it for PvP, but it actually is good in PvE, where it will target my last target if I target somebody else. And then it'll start using Rising Sun Kick, Blackout Kick, or Tiger Palm, which I could actually share those macros. Um, I'll, I'll put the macros in the description. And 
hopefully they're helpful for people. They were really helpful for me because you can just swap over and you can start doing damage if you start, you know, if, if you target somebody and then you, you can just tie your promise. It goes, just goes back to your back, last target. All right, listen to me. Okay, listen to me. I just want to kill this boss, okay? There is nothing more I want in my life than to kill this boss right now, okay? That's all I want. I just want to kill this boss. That's it. Please, sweet baby Jesus. I'm good. I'm good. I am good. So let's please kill this boss. Please. GG here. Put my back to it. Okay. First of all, dodge the breath. Second of all, put your back to the wind. For some reason. There we go. And then there's going to be a ring. And you just want to make sure you use the tornadoes to dodge the ring. So we're dodging the ring right now. Dodging it. I'm going to unuse trinket here. And we're going to chill. That's all we're doing. I'm just going to do as much damage as I possibly freaking can. Dodge the breath here, of course. Okay. Big damage here. Huge damage here. Massive damage here. Yep, good. Chi burst here as well. Good. I feel like I'm doing so much damage right now. Like, I feel like I'm on top of your damage meters right now. Okay, here comes the ring. We're going to use the tornadoes to avoid it. I'm going to use revival here. I also have a 10 stacker of Shaylin's gift, actually. Dodge the breath, of course. And we're going to cheat you here as well. Uh, we have the red debuff. You have to put your back to the wind. Okay, don't throw this. Don't, baby, don't, please. I'm talking about, I'm talking to me right now. Please don't throw this. Okay, perfect. Ring hasn't spawned yet. Good. Perfect. Chi burst here. She uh, not she uh, I'll, I'll send a 10 sacker. I'll send a 10 sacker. Good. Put my back to the wind. Todd. Oh my god, we killed it. Oh my god. That is the first time I've killed this boss on a non-14 keystone in so long. What? What's the highest? <laughs> Didn't kill it on the 18, I can tell you that. 15 is the last time I killed this boss. <laughs> All right. So we got we have like one, two, we have like three more pulls, and this, this dungeon's over. So let's just, I'm going to throw an envelope miss on the tank before this pull. Oh, hello. Don't know how I'm going to uh, Okay, I don't know what that's about, but. Okay, that was weird. Uh, maybe there was something I missed. I don't know. That was weird. Oh, it's just it's just AOE. Okay, that's my fault. Should have I should have known. My bad. Yeah, it's, it's just a ton of damage. Okay, that's my that's my fault. So I should probably dampen harm. Yeah. Okay. There we go. <clears throat> I would have been so sad if we finally kill that dumb boss. And then the, this little executor or whatever it's called kills us. I'm so sad. Okay, so we're just gonna chill. Good. Good. Perfect. And we have plenty of time to recover, too. I also have a 7 stacker. I might just send it right now. Um, yeah, I'm just going to send that. Just because the buff... I guess we kind of lose value on the buff, but the duplicate buff is... Eh. I kind of want the DR in haste. D DR is damage reduction in haste. Um, so any damage reduction, good. Any haste is good. You know, I'll take it. I'll take any haste uh, when I'm fist weaving. Uh, these these mobs have... this this. It's Mr. of Air. How am I meleeed, man? How am I freaking melee, dude? I'm so sad right now. Okay. Overload, so you just don't want to stand in the uh, triangle, sweep everything here, except for the big boy. Maybe I need to, I, you know what? I'll just wait for my tank, getting a little excited. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for my tank to pull. Okay, lightning lash, go into the tornado or go into the uh, pyramid when you see the lightning lash. And then you're safe. If you do not go in here fast enough, you will you will die. And then you get out of the overloaded grounding field. So that's pretty much the mechanic for Minister, Minister of Air. That, there's nothing else really to it. Um, but if you're not paying attention, it can kill you really quickly. So Lightning Lash, go into the pyramid for the full channel. And once it's over, you get out when he does the overload. Boom. That's, I mean, that's, that's it. That's all there is to it. Just got to pay attention. If you don't pay attention, you'll get one shot though. <laughs> so... You know, just make sure you're paying attention, I guess. Uh, I'm just gonna want, we're just gonna Todd this, and we're going to hopefully kill. Nice. See, if something like that happened where we didn't kill it fast enough, then we would be in trouble. Because uh, I'm just gonna 
I'm just going to sweep and then pray to Lord, please. I'm just going to go for the seven stacker. It's been a win. We're, we're, we have damage reduction haste right now, so we're just kind of spinning right now. We're going to be taking, I think, 15% less damage from everything, so that's pretty good too. Or 10? 15. Yeah, 15% 15 less damage. So you basically have a fort brew right now, a weaker fort brew, which is pretty solid. Okay. GG here. And we're just going to use our envelope mist. We're going to use our, that's the smash that we <laughs> almost wiped to before. I'm going to kick that. Chi burst here. I, I, Chi burst is so weird. I feel like it's okay, but it doesn't actually do a, whole, a heck of a lot. You know? I don't know. I'm going to go for a little four stagger here, though, to just top everyone off and then do damage here. Good. Good. We're killing it. We're crushing it right now. Nice. I'm just going to revival this to sweep everything. Yeah. Sweep and let's kick that and let's kill this guy. And oh my God. Potentially on part of two chests. This we'll see. Gnome that. Good. Good. All right. I don't have Chi-G for the start of this next pull, but I'm going to let my tank just pull. I'm going to throw an Envelope Mist on him. Okay. I do have Cocoon. All right. We're not going to get meleeed. I'm going to pre dampen harm here. We do have Chi-G now. All right. Perfect. Someone's getting Lightning Lashed. Okay. Perfect. And we recover. I don't think any of the pulls have like the lightning guy and the, uh, the crashing stone fella. So that's, that's what makes this pull a little bit more difficult, but I think it should be okay. I'm going to go for a Shailen's gift here. Lightning lashes on my shadow priest. He targets them, whoever gets chosen. So I might just target this guy just in case I, I, I want to see, you can actually put him on focus too, probably. And, and you should be able to see too. I didn't recover in time. It's my fault. Sweep everything. Uh, this one's on our dragon. Gnome racial this. Good. Gonna go for a three stacker here. Good. Overload. Don't stand in it. Good. Crushing stone here. Yep. We're gonna be okay. Rally. I'm just gonna rop. Lightning Lash is on my dragon. Beautiful. All right, good. He stood in it. We're going to get the overload now, which is fine. Perfect. And now it's just now it's just this guy. Now it's just this big boy. And we're going to... We're just going to tot him. Why not? Why not? Throw a little tot on him. And now we have the last boss. I think we have one more small pull with the the magical stars. I don't know. Listen, I don't know what they are. They're stars or something. Who knows? But that's one more pull right here. What are they? They're, they're stars. Hell yeah. Can be. And uh, <clears throat> that should be the last pull that we have before the last. Let me sweep everything. Throw an envelope mist out. And let's just spin here. Let's just spin to win. Healing elixirs. Big damage. Okay. And we do have revival for the last boss. Now, revival is kind of important on the last boss. Um, just because if people kind of mess up mechanics, you can use it. But for the most part, it's it's not this this boss has like a few mechanics, but we should be okay. So I'll kind of talk through them as well. And kind of uh go through it as much as I can at least. So right now I'm just putting hots out on everybody using Rising Sun Kick and then Tiger Palm Blackout Kick, Chinese Lightning. I'm just going to get out of the group. Pretty pretty simple. Just don't stack with that. And then we have the Sky Nova, which we want to kill ASAP. Uh, it does AOE damage. So we're just going to do some damage here. Static Cling, you want to jump towards the end. Revival, because some people uh, didn't jump. That's okay. But the reason why you wanted to spell it is because of Unstable Grounding. He's going to make this triangle right here. You need to stand in the triangle. Uh, and if you don't stand in the triangle, you're going to die. Because uh, he's going to do this huge supremacy of something. So keep that in mind. You could, uh, on your own, you could chain lightning here. I'm just going to dampen harm it. I think I was actually a little late. <laughs> um, but pretty much what you want to do is uh, you could use chi -G to actually immune the root on you. I'm just going to chi here. here. Uh, because we can cleave off two two people, right? So we should be able to just get blackout kicks. Static cling here. We need to jump. 
There we go. Perfect. Jump towards the end there. And we're also going to do a 10 stacker Shaylin's gift. Everyone's chilling. I think I kind of wasted Chi there, which is a little awkward. Uh, that one's that that's my fault for sure. Uh, definitely could have been more. Probably could have been better with that. And then that's pretty much the fight. Um, we do need to kill this. Chain Lightning is also going out. And we also have the mechanic. So a lot is happening right now, but pretty much just focused on the Nova. Static Cling. We're going to jump towards the end. Dispel the tank. Uh, you also have Tiger's Lust. If you ever find yourself rooted and you don't have Chi Gi, you could also use Diffuse Magic. Um, but for the most part, just jump towards the end and you'll be fine. Doing damage here. I have on use in 11. Good. Perfect. Chain Lightning, just get out with the group. Get out of the group. Nice. We're going to Chi here because why not? We're going to throw an Envelope Mist out. We have one of these. I'm going to on use here. Just throw an Envelope Mist out. Blackout Kick here as well. And we should Static Cling here. Diffuse Magic. It's fine. Cocoon. It's fine. And we got him. There we go. That is a 21 Vortex Pinnacle plus 43. We hit 2,700. Hell yeah. Uh, let's see what we got. If we got anything good. Oh. Don't hide from me. No. 